Hey there guys, Grey here, time for another reaction video. So I believe this is to a singer called, um, Hua Chen Yu. I've probably completely butchered that, my apologies if I have, but yeah. He's been suggested quite frequently actually since they first did the Dimash reaction videos and apparently he's more of a kind of rock singery kind of vibe so it might be a bit more up my street apparently. And also he apparently uses a lot of different styles in his singing so I'm kind of interested to hear how he incorporates all those into a song so I guess we'll see. Hopefully it's good. Quite pretty. Yeah, you can hear it there. It's really soft, really, not quite delicate, it's quite pointy, you know, very twangy compared to listening to a singer like Dimash, who has a much more classical kind of sound. It's a bit more rounded, a bit more broad, a bit more, in certain ways, reserved slightly. But yeah, I, I could hear it in his voice. I could tell he's going to start building into a rockier kind of tone, because you could hear it, that twangy, thin sound he's going for, even at a quiet volume, you could hear the little, little bits of distortion start to kick on ever so slightly. And if anyone's looking to develop grit, distortion, that kind of sound, I highly recommend learning to get that twangy, quiet bit first, because once you do that, you'll have your voice shaped the right kind of way to be able to do those sounds without having to just blow air to blow, you know, to make it happen. But yeah, where was it? There. It's leaning into it very low. Not a lot of it, but yeah, just about. Let's see how the rest of it goes. Yeah, sounds up my street. It's almost rapping with those verses. It's good. Yeah, very bright, very piercing, very classic rock. That kind of sound makes distortion easy, which is where you can get some easy power from as well. Yeah, it was good. Good song. Beautiful falsetto. Good range. Yeah. 
手牵过耳，手中蛋糕小纸，等他送上学校，立刻不早。Yeah, it's good. Yeah, good. Interesting performing style as well. much to say on it, to be honest. It was a good performance. Yeah. Yeah, very good. Yeah, it kind of makes me want to check out more hip-hop, to be honest, as well, because it's not something I relate to too much to listen to, you know, the way the verses are done and that, but yeah, if you guys want to suggest more stuff like that for me to check out, that'd be great, because I could definitely do a checking out more and just, yeah, seeing if I can get into it. But yeah, very good. His voice was good. Quite a bit of range on him. It was quite cool. Very good control over those softer dynamics. Again, if you're at all interested in doing rock singing or any of those fuller, shoutier kind of sounds, really, you figure you've got to train the loud stuff. But as every single one of these singers is demonstrating, it comes from getting those small, quiet ones, those really piercing bits right first, because that'll build the muscles you need to be able to do it. You can hear it in him when he's quiet. It starts to lean into those more distorted kinds of sounds, and that lends itself really well to the rock stuff as he demonstrates on the choruses. He's got that classic rock sound down, yeah, brilliantly. So yeah, I'd recommend working on that if you're interested in, you know, singing that kind of stuff. Focus there. But yeah, again, as far as performing goes, interesting performing style. Yeah, I'll have to watch some more videos, definitely. So yeah, cheers to everyone who suggested that. I quite enjoyed that. And yeah, hope to see you in the next video. Yep, tell very much. Take care till next time. Bye.